Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. So today I'm testing out Need for Speed Heat, and this was a user requested video. Cause I guess there's somebody out there that also has an i9 1400K CPU, and they're running into issues with this title. So I'm gonna go ahead and run it. First, let me go ahead and show you the graphics settings uh, that we're running. So we are running a render resolution of 3040 by 2160 on my 4K 150 hertz display. We will also test 1440p, cause that's one thing that the user did ask uh, if I could do. All the graphic settings are all ultra preset with everything turned up all the way. Uh, TA form of anti-aliasing and all these other settings are ultra uh, preset. So we're just gonna go ahead and make a short little video. We'll do a little driving around and then uh, we will do uh, 4K. I'm sorry, 1440p. But I guess they were experiencing some kind of frame time graph issues on their CPU and they weren't sure exactly what the issue was. So I'm making this video just to help them uh, show how it runs in my system. But enjoy guys, I'll be quiet for now. I'm a little bit rusty on the controls because I haven't played this title in a while. But that's how it runs at 4K, so now let's go to uh, 1440p here, and then we will do a race uh, to see how the game still runs. So go ahead and lower the resolution to 1440p. Save changes. Press the C key for accessibility options. Chat. And now we're at 1440p, it looks like. Uh, my visual fidelity looks a lot lower, but obviously it's going to run a little bit better, obviously, because it's such a lower resolution. But I'm not really experiencing any weird frame timing graph issues, so I'm going to say it seems to be fine. Okay, so now let's go back to uh, 4K and we'll do a race, and then uh, we'll wrap up the video. So we'll record the race, and we'll complete it, and then uh, we'll close up the video. But enjoy guys, I'll be quiet. But graphically, this game still holds up pretty nicely. I mean, this is like an older title now, but it still looks pretty, uh, pretty good, I'd say. I'm trying to get used to the handling model, it's a little bit different than what uh, some other games I'm playing now, but uh, graphically, it does look pretty decent. Okay, now just in case that person wants me to do a race at 1440p, so we're going to go back to uh, the graphic settings here and uh, change those to 1440p. We'll do one lap at 1440p, that way we get a balanced uh, test here.
Alright, now we'll go back to 4K and we'll leave it at that. Okay, so that wraps up the video. So I hope that person was appreciative of this video, because I did have to re-download uh, this title to uh, make this video. But uh, if you want, do uh, subscribe. I always make uh, gaming content, and I am running the same CPU as you, so... Anyways, if you guys did like the video, do give this video a like. If you want to see more content like this, more 4D90 game videos, more PS5 videos, uh, feel free to subscribe. So thanks for watching, appreciate all the support, and I'll see you guys around. Later guys, peace out.